So I thought I'd share with you my little findings of the day. Uh, normally I'm sort of out at lunchtime walking the pup, uh, but today I was a bit too busy in the morning. I actually had a little bit more to do in the afternoon, so I couldn't. So uh, luckily Jane walked her in the morning, and I managed to get these little guys at lunchtime um, from my office. I've got a three-story townhouse. My office is on the top. And I, yeah, I could hear these little guys twiddling around. You can't mistake the the vocal of the goldfinch. Um, but yeah, this little male here allowed me to take a picture like this, which was really nice. Nice colours. You can't go wrong with these little guys because they're so, so gorgeous anyway. Uh, but yeah, the sound sort of alerted me uh, to the hedgerow where the female was. And I could see through a very, very small gap um, the the dome of the nest. Um, I'm using a extender on my 600mm lens, so I'm probably about 800 plus. And I'm also cropping this in a bit as well, so I don't want to be too close because obviously, you know, I don't think there's any, any eggs in there yet, but I don't want to be disturbing anything around me. Um, this is literally, you know, opposite my window, and this is as close as I'm going to get. But you can see fairly well, she's, she's so clever. She's just made that out of, you know, lots of nice fresh twigs and uh, lots of fluff. And she's actually using her body to flatten the nest all around inside. And she's, you know, it's almost like the fluff is being a bit, it's kind of a bit of a glue on the edges. But yeah, she's, she puts her wings back and sort of pushes her chest down to make sort of a flatter a flatter part of the nest for the eggs which I'm really I'm hopefully they'll they'll um, they'll lay eggs fairly soon um, but yeah it's quite a public area sort of just at the front isn't it there was kids playing at the front and so they're not that bothered and the nice thing is is that they've actually got a bit of a obviously a bit of a partnership going on here this is the female the male um, who was you know very very attentive was here he is he's sitting in the tree probably about three or four meters just above and he's obviously calling to her, sort of saying, watch out, there's a guy with a big lens there. Or oh, there's some children screaming around there. Um, but they were very, very, you know, they, they didn't really care that much that we were all looking, or I was looking anyway. And um, yeah, so it was amazing to witness. And oh, yeah, I ended up sort of getting quite a bit of footage of them. And there's back to the female again. Um, and she's kind of using, as I say, the sort of the, the rounder part of her body just to flatten that, that Oh, that's amazing. But it's incredible just to see the colours of the bird as well. As I say, I had to use a, a sort of a manual focus on this. Uh, so I'm using sort of uh, peaking on the camera just to make sure I've got enough in focus. But I'll keep my eye on these little guys and hopefully they'll you know, have some babies there. And yeah, I might be able to get some on video.